Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to you to episode 7 of The Maid I Had Recently is Mysterious. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. What we learned today. Did I put my phone? Yeah, I did. Okay. <laughs> that graph is nothing but the maid graph. <laughs> oh my god. So, it's on your mind. Then, what's up? <laughs> She's all I think about. She's always on my mind. I can't. Oh my god. <laughs> Babe, that's love. <laughs> no, she's not okay. She's having a moment. We all have one. <laughs> As a person, um, hmm. that too, because you know, we have a lot of unanswered questions about her. <laughs> Just so shocked. <laughs> right? <it's laughs> Look at his face! Oh, that's jealousy with that. <laughs> oh, God, she's going to have another nosebleed. <laughs>
Mm-hmm. <laughs> Love sick, babe. That's all. I mean, well, you're more than friends. You're more than, you know, master and maids. Um. No. <laughs> love Mhm Mhm about someone a lot like when you get home and you see them you're just so happy and you want to be with them No, no, baby. He he doesn't hate you. He loves you. He's just trying to be like, what is the definition of love in his opinion? Nope. Nothing. She's worried that there's something wrong with you. Yeah. Which is? Mm-hmm. He's like Violet at uh, Evergarden in a way. He doesn't know the definition of love. He needs to find out in his own terms and his def- definition what is love for him. You're not going to show him porn, are you? Excuse me. 
Is it bland? Oh, uh, yeah, because your family. I mean, she is a maid after all. She's going to be good at everything. Don't you miss her? Baby, so in a way, still, you just want her all to yourself. Mm -hmm. She wants to be with no one else but you. Of course, we know so. <laughs> In a way, that is what love is. <laughs> the romance novels. That was so cute, oh my god. <laughs> Why well, I feel like he gonna draw a picture of <laughs> You just want her to stand there. You don't want her. Oh. <laughs> Gotta get the clothes ready as well.
Hmm? Aww. <laughs> <laughs> no, not like that. Yeah, just sitting down, being normal. Mm hmm. All the fair curling. Uh. Mm -hmm. Aww, baby. <laughs> So, can we see? Is there something wrong? Wait, Yuri! It looks fine! Yuri! <laughs> but... Uh, oh. See? Oh. You have bags under your eyes, baby. You gotta get more sleep. <laughs> oh, honey, you don't want that. You have to go to sleep at proper times. <laughs> Do you want some, you know, small lavender? Do you want some warm milk? <laughs> Then what do you want? Yeah, hot milk. Music? Hey, you know, get that laughy music up in there. Mm -hmm, for sleep sounds. Ooh. What you doing? Oh, honey. Mm-hmm. There you go. Oh, oh my 
my god! Well, of course. I mean, damn, the lullaby. <laughs> Are you not hungry? Mm -hmm. Oh, no. <laughs> well, that's your fault. Oh, God. Beautiful. A beautiful sketch. That was cute. I mean, number one, like, yes, you want to get enough sleep. Hell, I'm not only saying that to you guys, I'm saying that to me. Because let me tell you something. Being sleep deprived and then having to go to work for, like, seven hours coming home and then being tired after work and then you're tired in general and then you have to record oh that's like a kick my ass straight up kicking my ass that's why I tweeted what I tweeted and stuff and how I'm currently feeling like that I think you know th I think this week or really last week in a nutshell was a sad week for me and we're just going to turn around and we're going to make it a better week and a better last couple of months of this year because I want this year to kind of be over so bad. But going into this episode, this is sweet. I love in the way that he got to learn what de uh, the definition of love is and his terms. He's very similar to it, it's more of like, OK, so, you know, when you're in a relationship with someone and everyone has like their little um sort of like I think it's not pleasures but in the way it is and I'm not talking about like sexual types it's more of like you know um the one other thing almost still similar to the definition of love like the one thing is you know when you're in a relationship you're like oh hey I want you to spend time with me that's something or um there's one where your significant other will give you gifts and stuff um there's physical touch and stuff there's different ones where everybody has like a different thing and they're like okay this is how I feel and this is what I love even more about the person and such it's just about finding what that person wants and what that need is and giving to them whether it is you know um hanging out with them buying something like a gift for them or something to make them happy or just even spending time with them. And so I think in a way he's found out like, yeah, of course, his is definitely spending time with Lilith. Like, yes, his whole little graph was made time. Nothing but Lilith. Lilith is on his mind 24-7, 365 days of the year, every single moment of the time. Even when he sleeps, he probably dreams about Lilith. So, yeah, and I mean, it's probably the same for Lilith. Her her life 24-7, 365 days is all about Yuri. When she goes to bed, it's all about Yuri, the dreams that she has, and how she wants to take care of him and nurture her and nurture him and be there for him through everything, every little bit of his life. But yes, at the same time, she really, Yuri is getting feelings for her. And, you know, at the same time, <laughs> Lilith is like, yes, I can kind of like tease him in a way. But like at the same time, I'm over here, I'm like, yeah, you can do that. But you can't really actually fall in love with the child. He is a child, remember. But it's cute still, regardless, because they're just so fucking adorable. And I can't, even them staring a bed together and like eventually him falling asleep after she was singing to him like oh my god almost wanted to cry at that moment that was just too fucking adorable like oh 
that warmed my freaking heart. Like, oh my god. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 7 of the maid I hired recently is Mysterious. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join my squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially on Saturday. If not Saturday, Sunday morning. I'm going to try to do it as much as I can. I'll, hell, I'll even stay up if I have to for episode 8. Bye, guys.